Time to check in with Dylan for what we can expect today. Hey, Dylan. It's wild. Good morning, guys. It's wild to see the snow going sideways. That's how strong the wind is. Speaking of wind, want to focus on where we have the tornado watches right now. They're in effect till 9 o'clock Eastern time. This includes the panhandle of Florida moving into northern Florida, where we do still have severe storms. I will point out that the storms will not be as severe as yesterday. I don't think this is a tornado outbreak situation, but we do still have the chance of seeing wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and isolated tornadoes could spin up down through the Carolinas into Georgia and northern Florida. On the other side of this storm where the snow is falling, we still have winter storm warnings, blizzard warnings in effect for those reduced visibilities and those gusty winds. And then we stretch this over into the northeast where not only do we have uh, the snow is a concern, but ice is a major concern down through Pennsylvania into West Virginia and Virginia too. So we do have some colder air on the northern side of this storm system as it makes its way into the northeast. So any snow and ice will change over to rain as the warmer air rushes in. This is going to continue to move in through the day today, tonight, and then uh, try to exit New England as we go into Friday night. So additional snowfall, about 6 to 12 inches, back through the upper Midwest and the northern plains. In the northeast, it's mostly the ski resorts that would get your two feet of snow, but we're still looking for the interior northeast to pick up around 6 inches. And then the ice could be up to a quarter of an inch, which is enough to cause significant damage in that part of the country. All right, Dylan, lots to watch. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.